into the sky Never let adventures pass you by Be free and follow your crazy dreams We're living our vision in the RV Come ride with us and you'll be free Hi. Today we're going to share our must-have space-saving gadgets. Want to see them? Sure they do. They do? You do? Yep. Well, come on in. Come on. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Just one of you at a time, probably. Yeah. Our first item in the closet here is our laundry bag. It's a mesh bag. Please don't show my skivvies. No. Okay. Uh, very handy to just grab and go to the laundromat. And mm -hmm. another little space saving thing we do is we actually roll all our dirty clothes just like that, just like you would to um, pack to go travel in here to make them even more compact. But the mesh bags work really well for us. Uh, we don't have a big launder basket type thing. Fits right stows away right there in the shelf. Mm -hmm. Works great. Found in our Amazon store. Another item we like are these hangers. They're very slim. They have a rubber uh, rubberness to them, I guess you would say. <laughs> They're rubber coated so your clothes don't fall off. We first got them when we had our Airstream Classic 33 foot because of the closet in it due to the curvature of the Airstream and uh, just the size of the closet, the depth was very short. So we needed to have a shorter hanger and we found these, they're great. And now they have transitioned well into our very tiny closet in this van because uh, it's more shorter width wise instead of depth wise. Again, those are also in our Amazon store. The next thing that we found is this little four drawer, kind of like an end table or a nightstand, but it's, uh, we got it at Target and it's really handy for this specific van, the Strata Ion by Gretsch. And we leave this table up. Michelle likes to use it to put her purses on there. We still have plenty of room for this, for the seat to come back. We've got it pretty much all the way back right now. Also, there is extra space that easily slips out. We had a container at first that we just threw everything in and put it in there and we found that to, it was so hard to digging stuff out and it was just kind of a pain. We wanted something that we could put the shoes separate so that our dirty bottoms of our shoes weren't touching stuff in a big compartment that we did have down there. So we just found that this worked better. These two I put some camera gear in and it works really well. We use this also as another table. We stick this on here. This never does fall when we're driving. It has a little ledge here that keeps this from coming off. Uh, I like put the tripod here also. This has come in handy in so many different ways. This seat doesn't go down far enough for us short people. When I'm sitting here working, I'll have my lap desk here and I just put my feet up on it and it just makes it nice and easy. So as you can see, if I don't, this is how my feet are. So that, that really helps out for that. And if Gretsch puts this table back like we used to like, this little folding table that came up here, I used to put this on top of that little folding table. And then my little lap desk would sit right there and I would just stand here and work. Not a huge deal because sometimes I can just put it just like that. This also comes in really handy for outside. When I'm wiping down the side of the van, I can't reach up high to wipe it down this side. But if I have this, this gives me just enough that I can get up there and wipe that down. And it, as you can see, it just folds away so easily. And I just put both of these right here, one on top of the other. Voila! The next item, simple little item, it's here in our freezer, 
and it's these little silicone trays. You probably have seen them when we first bought these. They weren't very popular, and I think when we first got them, we got them at Whole Foods. That was the first time we had ever seen them. Now you see them all over the place. We do have these on our Amazon store. That stool, by the way, is on our Amazon store also. We have two of these, and it gives you 15 ice cubes. We usually put only one cube in for like our shakes, and uh, one or two in for a drink, That if we make a drink. We really, we have two of them, and we really only need one. We could take one of these out and just put it away somewhere, and give us a little bit more freezer space, because by the time we, this gets low, we put more water in it, and by morning, they're frozen. Next. You're in my bubble. <laughs> Down here in this little drawer mm -hmm. is our handy dandy broom set. What? That's a. I've never <laughs> seen one of those. But these come in very handy for uh, sweeping off the, the step. If you're in a sandy area, sweeping off the little uh, the area there in the front. In your entryway. In the entryway, your chalk set and your blocks. And it fits good, and especially in that little space right there. Correct. This uh, this drawer, by the way, is new in this um, with this different refrigerator in the 2023 model, and I think it's going to be that way in the 2024 also. This little drawer has been very handy. This is perfect. It's a little travel iron, and we use this with our little handy dandy small ironing board. Oh yes. Should I show them the ironing board? Sure. Alrighty then. Well, let's go back here, and up here we have an ironing board. It's got these little legs on it, get pulled up, and then we can just set it on the countertop right here and do our ironing, right? Yep. And then we just stick it right back up in there. Next. Bada bing, bada boom. Next on our list, if you like I'm in the wrong compartment. <laughs> my mom and I think my sister were shopping one day and got these for us. But you, we've got them on our Amazon store. Um, that You can find them all over the place now. But it's a hard-boiled egg maker. You can do poached eggs too. Uh, you can do kind of a scrambled egg thing for like if you're going to have a, a biscuit sandwich or something. You can put it in that. We only use this for hard-boiled eggs. It comes with this little thing here. You put, has a little line on here for water. You pour the water in this. You take this thing off the bottom. It has a little poker. And you poke little holes on the top of each egg. And then you set it up. I think it's like 10 minutes or something like that. And then you, after it's done, it beeps. It comes with instructions. Don't listen to me, but it's very quick. And that way you don't have to get out a pot and boil water and weigh using up energy like if you have propane uh, cooktop you don't have to use up your propane uh, use your you know RV parks electricity with this and it's much quicker and very easy to clean up and they also have which we don't use much a little same thing but a little waffle maker might as well talk about these. You guys have heard us talk about these little containers before we had these in our Airstream also and these uh, containers are so nice because if you get the hard containers, you can only fit so much. With these, you can like you can put as much as you want in there, and when you push them into a space that's small, they kind of form to that space. So it allows you uh, a little bit more room. You heard us talk about this too, but we got rid of our Ninja blender and all of its attachments, and we just use this super handy we've you've heard us talk about this in other videos also uh, it's the blend jet uh, a couple of our friends son is the inventor of this owns the company super easy to make our shakes we do this for lunch a lot we make our protein drinks with avocado and that you've seen that recipe before probably but it's really easy to clean too and uh, blends up ice really nice they have all kinds of designs they have a couple different sizes i believe and you can get these on blendjet.com of course again that's blendjet.com or walmart has them you've seen them at walmart but you can't get all the designs at walmart so if you really want to uh, expand your choices we'd suggest going to uh, blendjet.com something else i wanted to point out while i'm in here is the space that this uh, gretch has 
the, these paper towels, you wouldn't think they would fit, but like we have this other space sa saving uh, item here that is not on our list. Again, we're just gonna do our 15 that we chose, but there's so many different things that out there for space saving. But um, this paper towel, and a full paper towel will actually sit there and this will still close. Doesn't look like it will, but since the curvature of this is like that, it closes without touching. I'm next gonna talk about our towels. We just purchased these not too long ago from REI. We love that store. We spend way too much there. <laughs> and uh, they are very handy because they are thin. And I'll show Very you. absorbent. Very absorbent. I'm gonna show you the difference. This is the type of towel we used to have. And this is what we have now. So as you can see, rolled up there are quite a bit difference even turn them the turn them the other way too like directionally towards oh. me yeah yeah that shows the thickness of them yeah. better the other thing we like about them is they don't stick out so much so when passing by it just doesn't feel so confined they also have a hook which our other towels didn't and so they never fall off if we have them hanging up here when we're traveling oh and there's more because they do come with a little bag too if you want to take them camping in a tent <laughs> <laughs> but wait there's more we have another set of towels these are beach towels that we got they're called wise owl and they are also very compact we found them on Amazon and we have them in our Amazon store this is what we had before is beach towels so you can see right. quite a bit of difference get the second one out to show We have two, takes up quite a bit less space. And I'll just show you how big these are. These are very big. It has its own strap. Oh my goodness. Like, they could be a blanket, really. That is huge. Where did Michelle go? Next on our list is our camping chairs. We have two of these. We had, I think we had these in the Airstream too, didn't we? We did. Okay, I thought so. Um, they're just very nice space saving. When we originally got these, we got them at Costco, but since then we've noticed that Costco doesn't have them anymore. But lucky for you, we found them on Amazon and uh, we do have these in our Amazon store. And then I was searching around and I saw another set of chairs that are very similar to this except they have an armrest that has a cup holder and a little pouch down below, right below where you sit there to put things in. They're very similar, but I thought if somebody needed a cup holder, uh, it actually holds a bottle or a, or a can. I don't, it wouldn't hold like a mug, anything like that, I don't think. But I put them on there too, just in case, so that you could, uh, you could see those as a choice also. Um, we would like to try, we haven't tried those yet, but we'd like to try those to see what they're like. It's just a little extra step putting them together with those. You have to put the arms on too, but it's another option. And they come in a small bag similar to this. But yeah, so you can get them on the Amazon uh, store and uh, they have the little legs that kind of go in together and then you just slip the top on two slots in the bottom and you're, and you're good. Um, not as easy to put together as a chair that you just unfold and you're done, but when you need space, something like this really helps. Again, there's one of those sacrifice things. If you, uh, if you need more space, then you gotta sacrifice somewhere and we have nowhere really to put big chairs. We could stick them up back there if we wanted to, but that would not look good and it would take away from our nice organized space back there. We have two of those and they both uh, fit up there really nice. What else was there? Oh, and while I'm back here, Another space saving thing is this little vacuum, a little shark ultra cyclone. Um, there's a little canister here that you put, release the button and you can empty it outside and in, or in your trash can. But it's uh, nice and slender and small, so it fits right up in here. Cordless, has some little attachments too, a little brush, a little crevice uh, attachment tool to get into a smaller area put on the end here and then your power cord uh, that um, we did not find this 
in our Amazon store, but we got this at either Walmart or Target is where we got it. We can't remember which one, but I did see one on Amazon that I thought might be better. It's even thinner and it's supposed to have more suction power. So we, I put that in our Amazon store for you to look at to see what you think. But um, that's it. We got a bonus. The bonus item is this little thing right here. What is that? That is a collapsible cone. As you can see, it fits really nice and easy right there. Nice and handy. And uh, as a matter of fact, we're going to use it right now because we're ready to go. We're ready to go. Okay, now we're going. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel, click that little bell, and hit that thumbs up. See you next week!